What is going on guys? Memory here bringing you guys my review for the second season of Rosario Vampire and before I even get into this I don't know if I pronounce Rosario right because my brother said it's Rosary but I say Rosario and I've looked it up online and it's pronounced Rosario online but my brother says I pronounce it wrong because in the show I guess they say Rosary but Rosary and Rosario are two different words so I don't know if I say it right or not but who the fuck cares um so season two of Rosario Vampire, um, I actually really enjoyed it. I enjoyed it more than season one, and mainly because the in every episode you don't see the same thing happening. Like in every episode, you don't see Mocha getting her thing ripped off uh, by Skune, Skume, Skune, however you say it. Uh, you don't see that getting ripped off in every episode, and I like that. And there's always something different happening in every episode. Which sometimes it got a bit crazy and out of hand, like the the one episode with the curry. I thought that was crazy. Like everybody was like turned yellow and shit, and it was pretty crazy. Uh, so that was like something I didn't really like. But I liked how there was something different in every episode. And another thing, uh, we're introduced to Mocha's sister in uh, season two, which is pretty sweet. And she likes Mocha in her vampire form because that's what she's used to when they were kids and they used to fight all the time. But now Mocha's the girl with the pink hair and like she's not her old self as uh, her sister has saw her. And yeah, so I really liked it. And not gonna give like I don't want to give away the ending real, uh, really because. The ending was really good, like better than the ending of the first season. I thought the first season's ending was really good, and the second season two's um, ending was really good. Was better than season one's ending because something crazy happens, and it's actually with the rosary on her chest. And don't want to really give it away, but because I know probably some people haven't watched it, uh, so I, I say that in every review I do of these because maybe some people haven't, but um. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm giving it an 8.5 out of 10. I wish I could put 8.5 on my anime list, but I can't. So I'm probably going to just put an 8 out of 10, but I'm giving it an 8.5 out of 10. I really enjoyed it. The girls the, the girls like took it more of like further, if you want to say, in Season 2, and I like that. Uh, Kurumu was herself. She always rubbing up on Skune. Skune. God damn and Yukari, actually the one episode Yukari just becomes a grown ass woman and it's crazy like she's fucking hot as hell in one of the episodes and I thought I, I really like that episode now that I'm thinking about it and yeah that's pretty much it don't want to give away the ending really oh yeah and at the end of at the in the last episode at the end it definitely leaves off to where I don't know if it's been announced or if I'm just slow but I'm pretty sure there's going to be a season 3 I mean it left off to where his, um, Mocha's sister is like, um, I'll get you, I'll get you to your normal self or some, I forget what she said, but I literally just finished watching it and I forgot, but her sister's like, I'll get you to your original form, uh, original self, uh, later or something, or I'll get revenge or some shit like that. But her sister's not really that evil. Like you see a soft side to her in the ending when she helps out Skume and I thought that was pretty sweet. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Didn't want to really spoil the ending because it's pretty good. If you guys have not watched the second season, if you guys have not watched the series as a whole, I really recommend it. Uh, now looking back at it, the first season wasn't all that bad. I just hate the I just hate how it was like repetitive and stuff like that. So yeah, if you guys understand where I'm coming from, leave a like, comment, subscribe. It really helps me out. Let me know what you think about the series if you've watched it so far. And that's about it. See you guys. Peace out.